Hello everyone, I am Nutrix the Synth Guy and today I'm testing a wireless microphone. I did that a month ago with the company Fafine and I tested this microphone which works well and it's surprisingly efficient for the price because you know this is like $50 Canadian so uh, very affordable. Uh, it's aimed for karaoke and I talked about it so probably if you're interested click on that link to, to see it. But that was already a, an interesting product for the price, especially. But today I have another one from Fafine, or Fafine. Let's say Fafine. Um, and this one is, again, a wireless microphone. And you've got the paper, you've got a little booklet explaining what it is. And it's a wireless microphone lavalier like this one here so i'm going to unbox this i'm going to plug it in and you'll hear the difference between the microphone i use every day and this one um, the advantage for me in this one is you get a headset so meaning when i'm going to turn my head it, the microphone will stay in place so that could be really interesting so there's a microphone let me just show you what it is is there is a kind of a headset Okay, I'll take this thing out. Wait a sec. And in that headset, there's a there's a microphone over here. So you have to turn this so it's going to be aiming at where you're talking. And this is for getting rid of the wind or when you talk of uh, air blowing out of your mouth, especially for the P's and the F. So let's put it back on. Okay, so that's where it is. So that's one thing. This has no headphones. It's really just a headset so it doesn't fall. And the connector that you have here is made to connect then to this one. Either you plug it into the uh, recording system or the speaker or the mixer. So that's going to be for that. This is the other microphone. So you got two microphones for this one. You got the one that is on the headset. And this one that is a traditional lavalier. So again, a clip you have here. You see the clip um, that you can actually, usually you can move that. Like this, okay. And you can open and close depending what you need. Where to, to clip on your clothes. And this one, if we look at this. It's actually bigger than the one I have, so it might be more in interesting on how the voice will sound. So I'll see, I'll test. Again, same type of connector. This goes into the wireless pack. So this would go, go into this, and then you need to turn it on. I need to put some battery in first. There we go. I don't have the batteries. And this will actually be to connect this into, in my case, that's the connector I have. No, no, I have this one. But you could have this depending on if you want to connect to your camera, let's say. This would be on your camera and you would go from this to your camera. So you have this thing here. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put some batteries in these things and we'll test the two of them. So we'll see how it sounds. And you press on this, you go to the next one. Okay, and this is actually red, so it works. So let's plug it in. And if I switch between the two, you hear me, yes. Now you hear my voice, actually. 
there's some let's switch I hear a lot of noise do you hear it the microphone itself sounds okay the microphone doesn't sound bad honestly it's an interesting sound um, but I hear a lot of background noises Hear that shh at the end. If I get closer, if I'm away, it's actually a lot better now. Now it's a little bit, I, I'm kind of distorting right now. I think I'm too loud. I'm going to bring that down here. Is it better? Yeah, that's a little bit better. I think my voice is less distorting. And the, the background noise is a lot better. I might be able to get even a better noise floor with new batteries. Uh, sensitivity is high enough. Let's bring that down. So if I talk louder and I'm distorting a little bit, bring that down a little bit. So if I'm actually, this is actually better. I'm actually wireless right now and I put it at the same place as the other one. I'm using the headphones because I want to hear what I'm doing if I'm not distorting or anything. So I have this, this is the, the new one. And I'm just going to switch back to the other. So you hear my original microphone. That's the other one. That's that's the other one. So they don't sound the same, and they don't have the same sensitivity. Like this one is less sensitive, which is good and bad in, in a way. Now I need to bring up the volume, so I'm picking up more of the room itself. Whereas if I'm going back to the wireless one, it's 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 a lot more sensitive. So I need to bring down the volume, so I have something that is less distorting or I, I get less of the background noises. So, I mean, all the microphone, they don't have the same response. Now, I'm gonna take this out. Is it better like this? Does it have any, any difference in the sound? If I play it like that, if I mode it, this is more distorting. But if I if I put it like this, I think I can have some, something really decent with this. So, wireless and lavalier, so that's one. Actually, now I'm going to test out the other one. This is the same transmitter. I just have to connect the headset on it. So, headset, let's try this. So, so let's, let's, we don't have to put it right into the mouth because that's just too much. If you, and if I go like this, it's going to, still going to pop. And, but it's, it's actually, um, not a bad thing. Uh, maybe too loud again, like this. This is might be too. This is interesting because with this, um, there's there's you don't hear other noises. That's that's a clean one. That's a really clean one. If and if I if you hear too much of the pop, you need to move it away so it doesn't go straight to your mouth. Uh, if it, it could even be like this. So now you're kind of recording like here. And I'm talking here, so I'm talking into that bubble of space that it's recording into. But it sounds okay, you know. So that's the one. That's the headphone. Actually, that's a headset. It's. Uh, I don't think it's the same microphone. It doesn't look like the same capsule. Physically, it's a little bit different. It means that's here. It's very sensitive to only this space. So that's really interesting. It could be really good, but the problem is that, see, if I go too loud, it distorts. So it's really sensitive. So it means it might have to go like this instead. And A, if I sp speak louder, it doesn't distort as much. So you have to figure out where is the best place to put it, like any microphone. But if you want to wear this with headphones, then it's not, a, it's not really cool because you already have this on your ear. So try to figure out what else, how else I can actually use this. But, um, or you have just a head, you know, one earbud in the other ear. So if you have earbuds, it could actually work. And this, I'm not even sure I'm wearing the right way. I guess so. I don't really see this. No, this, this has no, this has no logic. Like, it should be like this. Is it? Yeah, it should be like this. That's that's how it should be. But that's it. Um, 
I would still like to have, because you can, I can put this on top of this, but it's really not comfortable on that side. This side is okay. So if I'm going to use this, I'll use, I'll use earbuds instead of this. But if you're a talker in front of a group and you don't have your headphones, then that's really good because as you move around, you're always staying in the same place for the microphone. So you don't have to bring up the volume and have some compression or stuff like that. So this is, this is I think, for a person walking around on stage and talking, that's a good option. And again, you need to figure out not to put it too close to your mouth because it will distort. Well, that's real for any microphone. You have to figure out where you put it for the person who actually talks in it and get the right volume. But um, the sound of it, I think, is really good for voice. And I might actually use it. I'm just maybe not with headphones because that's, that's kind of a uh, not as fun to wear. Or figure out a way to maybe change how this actually position itself. But that's pretty nice. So you have this one. You have, and if you want to compare again to my microphone that I use most of the time, let's try this. And that is the microphone I use most of the time. It's this other microphone here. Let's place this a little bit better. This is the one I use almost every time. So this one is a little bit less sensitive, but I get more of a room tone, room sound with it. So, interesting. So, for, for fine, you've got these different microphones. This one more aimed at uh, maybe a talker, um, because it's, it's, it's actually really good to stay in position with your mouth, um, yeah, with, with your voice. This one, the lavalier, again, you've got these two, the transmitter, the receiver, for like $34 US, so about you know, 45 Canadian. For the price, I think that's, uh, that's really, really, really good. And uh, if you need something like that, you know, look up for fine microphones, because for the price, I don't see a lot of other options for that price. That's it, guys. If you like what you're doing, thumb up, subscribe, and put the little bell notification light on so you get notified every time I put out a new video on YouTube. Cheers. See you next time.